Good morning, Card Community. It's RJ. Today is Sunday, and it is time for the trivia recap video of the week. Kind of an exciting day, the first one of the new format. Hopefully it goes well for everybody. Um, as you recall, we had trivia questions dropped on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Two days for you guys all to answer and send in the correct answer. And then I'm taking all the correct answers from each of those days, slapping it into this here picker wheel, which is the way I like to randomize things and uh, spin away and get ourselves a winner. Now, I don't like, um, I, I have so few entries in my contest. I'm a small guy here, uh, barely 200 subscribers. Maybe if I'm lucky, I'll get 50 people to watch a video and, you know, 10 comments if I'm lucky. So to get, um, you know, I think this one has nine people who threw an answer out at me. You know, I'm pretty, it's pretty good. But then to take those nine people and spin and get one winner, I always think is a little under dramatic. So I, I try to do something different. Uh, the last two times I ran contests with a picker wheel, what I did was I said, okay, we're going to spin until somebody's name comes up three times. So we're going to do that for each entry today. And I'll keep that format as long as I have a uh, few enough people to make it uh manageable to do it that way okay until somebody's name comes up three times so there's your list of people who got the answer correct i'm not going to read them off to you they're right there in front of you and we're going to spin this wheel and the wheel has a picker um option to keep count of who wins so we'll do that until somebody's name gets done three times i'm going to spin twice just to mix up the names a bit so you don't think i had some kind of uh pre-arranged order or anything so Okay, so boom flank there does not count. That's the first randomized one. So I'm going to randomize it one more time. And then we're going to start the picking. And this is why you randomize it, so that boom flank doesn't get too right away. A reminder real quick of the trivia question. On Monday, I asked, what did the Reds receive in exchange for Frank Thomas? And I, the answer is Milt Pappas, Dick Simpson, and the great Jack Baldwin who, if you know Jack Baldwin, I think his only claim to fame is being part of this trivia question. But the prize is a 1952 reprint of Mickey Mantle's rookie card. This is from 1996 Tops. So whoever's name gets snagged three times here will win that card. So good luck to everybody. This is the first official pick, and we will keep count. You'll see the pick wheel pop up a thing that I can keep count with. So... Count one, boom, walk and balk is in for one thing. I tried to use um, everybody's YouTube name or, you know, the best I could remember if it was as Card Closet just got the hit. If the email I got doesn't have their email at the name, but has their real name, I tried to remember what their email or the YouTube, which it's a YouTube name was. So, wow, walk and balk gets another one right up front. That's scary. Usually I'll have, you know, everybody get one before somebody gets three. Walk and Buck pulls way out in the lead real quick. Almost won it right there. Sir, you were real close. But Sticks G got in there. Walk and Buck got in there real quick with two. Unbelievable. I've never seen that before. Sticks G right away with two. Boy, maybe I got to pick a different, uh, maybe I got to pick a different picker because this is ridiculous. I've never seen that before. Every time I've done this, I've never seen two people get such quick hits. Here you go, Jason, VT Sports Guy. If Jason wins, I don't think I have Jason's contact information. A lot of these people are regulars to my YouTube channel, so I got a lot of their contact information. Really? Okay. So, this is a random picker, people. It is not something that I have ever had this experience with before. But Styx G has just hit three times that fast. I, I've never seen that before. So, hey, congrats to 6G. Sticks, uh, I know Sticks well, and I will send out this Mickey Mantle card to Sticks ASAP. Congrats to Sticks on that. Sorry for everybody else, but let's move on to Tuesday. A lot of you guys are... All right, moving on to the Wednesday drawing. Um, Sticks, since you won on Monday, I'm going to drop your name off of this one. It's one of the policies I have for my trivia winners. I don't want to ever give out 
uh, the prize to the same person over and over again. So if you win once during the week, you cannot win again during the same week. I think it's a little fair to everybody else. Reminding everybody what, what um, Wednesday's question was. I showed you this card out of the 1994 Common Collection Burgundy Parallel set. It said, who is the man whose nickname was Tarzan? And the answer is Roy Parmelli. Uh, everybody who gave me a correct answer is up on the board there. Some people did chime in, but their answer was incorrect, so you won't see your name there. And again, Sticks Six, Six G did answer correctly, but I'm dropping him because he won for the Monday thing. So as we did previously, we're going to spin twice. One. Boom, does not get a tally. This is just to randomize everything before we do the regular ones. And again, so, so, does not get a tally here. So let us begin. So the first person to hit three times is going to win. Um, don't get a lot of viewers to my channel. These people, Mickey Carico gets a tally. Um... Those people who uh, regularly watch are going to be the ones who are up here. Hopefully this will draw more people to the channel. Self to Pride, one, two, three, four. It's a tally. Um, I'm a big trivia fan, so I enjoy this kind of stuff. Wow. Self to Pride, one, two, three, four, with two quick hits. I'm shocked. I, this picker wheel thing doesn't seem to be working too well for me anymore. It's not randomizing very well for some reason. Boom, slang with a hit. Yeah, I'm not sure if I want to keep going with the picker wheel if, if I get done this quick. Oh my gosh, really? Boom, slang with another hit. I thought this would make it a little bit more easy for everybody to get a chance by doing it th until somebody hits three times, but this sucker is, is nailing quick on everybody. All right, Jeremy Michaels gets in with one. That's good. So who's, oh, poor Shaw Racing Collects is getting shut out here. Come on now, Shaw. Let's go, Jeff. <laughs> oh, is this it for Mickey? I think this is Mickey's second. Yeah, this is Mickey's second. All right, so we got three people on the board now with two. So it's looking like this next spin might might decide on the, the robbing you out card. So what do we got? There it is, Mickey. That is it. Mickey, that is Mickey's third hit. Mickey, I don't think I have your, your contact information. I don't believe I have Mickey Carico's contact information. This is the prize, the 1986 uh, style. Uh, this is from 2021 Tops, an insert. Uh, it is the blue parallel, 86 all-star design. So, Mickey, you're going to have to shoot me out an email with your uh, contact information or if anybody else has it out there who's watching this has Mickey's uh, contact information, they're welcome to email me. My email will be included in the um, description below for that reason. So here we go. And I'm going to drop sticks from this one too. Mickey didn't chime in with a good answer here. Um, this was uh, Friday's question. Friday's question was uh, another simple one, very easy question or simple question who was this guy, but I didn't have a lot of people chiming in with the right answer because that is not a baseball player or anybody or, you know, associated with baseball per se. That is Charles Conlon, the namesake of the Conlon collection. He was the photographer who took all those great pictures over the years. So that was his card in the set. And the prize for that day was this here gold, Topps Gold Giancarlo Stanton card from 2018. You can see there it's serial numbered 521 out of 2018. So that was the prize for that day. And the individual who is going to win that will be determined now. Um, let's spin. Again, we're going to spin twice. To, well, you know what? Since there's only three people here, I'm not even going to waste my time randomizing it since there's only three of you guys. So let's just spin and see who can get the first three uh, snags, first three hits, all right? What do we got? We got Boom. Boom's on the board with one. All right, let's do it again. These guys are three uh, regular viewers of my channel, typically. Certainly Shaw. 
Boom, Shaw, there you go. Come on, Shaw. Actually, I don't want Shaw to win. Two people from Canada in the same week. Ooh. <laughs> Sticks already won. Here we go, Celtic Pride. So all three, this is what I'm normally used to seeing, is everybody gets one hit, and then we keep going. That's what I used to see all the time. This quick and done is surprising to me. Yeah, Celtic Pride gets one. Almost done. Hope everybody had a great week. Snowed up here in Pennsylvania this past two days. Booms got two. Celtic Pride got two. This one might decide it unless Shaw pulls it out. Let's see what happens. This could be the end, people. And there it is. Celtic Pride. One, two, three, four. That's Keith over there. He gets the final tally. So... There you have it, people. Um, that is going to be the new trivia format. Uh, you know, I'll have them all with picker wheels. As long as the picker wheel's working for me, I think I'll keep it. Um, yeah, well, I'll be back again this coming week with more three more trivia. Actually, I only have two trivia uh, questions this week. Ed Wednesday is a, a different video, a little preview for you. But um, there will be more trivia and prizes next Sunday. I uh, hope everybody enjoyed that. Do me a favor, give me a comment below. Tell me what you thought of this. This is the way it's going to be going forward for a while. I think it's more interesting. Hopefully it'll draw some more people to my channel with a chance to win something and a fun way to do it, I hope. So thanks for everybody to take time to uh, view my channel. Again, I got about 200 subscribers now. And maybe, maybe if I hit 50 views for one video, that's, that's a lot. And you all, maybe I'll get 10 comments. So for me to have this limited number of people answering quick trivia questions. I get it. I understand it. So that's why I do it. Um, I do the trivia pick wheel thing a little different than just one and done. I think, it, like I said, it adds more drama to the whole process. So hope you all enjoyed that. Please consider liking, subscribing, commenting, all that jazz. And uh, please take time and stop by this coming week for some more. All right. Uh, thanks again to everybody who watched. Appreciate you coming out. Have a good weekend. Take care.